Welcome to another edition of HMG Live Highlights. Here is the best of our stimulating and thoughtful Charlotte CIO Virtual Summit. And the reason I love IT is that we have systematically always seen horizontally, looked across the organization, and now we can take that to the next level by thinking of that data transition across the many different functions to deliver that customer journey for our, for our customers. As Hunter pointed out, there's a, there's a lot of uh, changes happening in our environments uh, throughout the country, throughout the world. And it turns out that AI is actually having a big moment. Um, it is having a direct impact on the changes specifically in the world that we think about, which is IT support and this transition to work from home. Be a builder of velocity in your company. Speed and direction is the definition of velocity. And, um, you know, we're going through so much um, as an economy, as companies that, um, we really have to set good direction for the company as the IT leaders because it is about digital transformation. And then we've got to be quick, 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 quick about it. Culture matters. Culture leadership, leading in a tough environment matters. Um, and leading in this with cl these new collaborative tools that are now the new standard matters. I think uh, most organizations are 90% virtual and digital. Thinking differently and not necessarily thinking about the security within the four walls. Yes, that's the easy way, but that's not the way we need to evolve. And I think this pandemic has really just shown us um, that we need to change with the times. Previously, the IT executive was focused just on IT stuff, but Everything has sped up. IT was, frankly, the rescuer of many organizations, you know, the hero, and the voice of IT leadership is now magnified dramatically. So really, what people are looking for is, how were you positioned? What did you do? How did you execute? How did you communicate? What were the, let's call it the hard skills around making tough decisions, doing tough things, but then what are the kind of the soft skills that went around that? And when I look at what it takes to be successful within this environment, to me, that is the number one thing, is really figuring out how to be a person first. How do you make sure that you're, you're thinking about your teams you're thinking about the people that you work with every day. You're really being interactive with them, not just in a way that is, let me get the job done. Yes, that's important. That's what we're paid for. That's why we come to the job every day. But how do I let them know that I care about them as people? You know, the, the humanity aspect of being able to connect digitally now is, is really starting to come forth. I think we've now got an entire generation uh, of, of people that have, have been trained to connect this way. And Virtual events like these are plentiful. This happens to be the five star mm -hmm. out of everything that I think we've experienced. The future proofing way of IT and IT security is flexibility. So um, always look for controls, especially as we're addressing the situation that are incredibly flexible and can fit a variety of different future use cases. How can we uh, do what uh, supply chains are doing. They've gone from just in time to just in case. And our thinking has entirely changed to um, how, what do we do just in case if this doesn't work? We have to be much more resilient, I would say overall, than we have been in the past because, you know, we're going to have hurdles and roadblocks that have come our way. We've all experienced it. And I think one measure of our success is how well we overcome them. Let me start with, uh, you know, empathy and courage. So, you know, we are really in an unusual time right now between the pandemic and the racial issues that are happening in the U.S. that um, I, I really think that corporations and leaders have to lean into this in ways that we haven't had to do before. I, I sort of grew up in an environment that was sort of, you know, don't step into those politically charged topics. But today's environment, if you don't, and you come, you and your company don't take a stand on some of the injustices that we see, I think what you're going to see is talent's going to flee um, and customers are going to flee because people want to do business with people that they actually believe in. Another great event. Really appreciate uh, the ability to have such uh, great conversations. Uh, you know, really some smart folks on the line and uh, I think a great forum for it. The definition of courage that I'll leave you with is going outside your comfort zone. That's all it is. If I stay in my comfort zone, not very courageous. If I'll step out of my 
a comfort zone and do things I haven't done before and try things and say things that I haven't done before, then I'm being courageous. And that's the multiplier effect. We hope you enjoyed these great moments. You can watch the entire summit and browse our archive of recent virtual experiences by visiting hmgstrategy.com. You can also check out our schedule of upcoming summits and register to attend future events. HMG Strategy is your number one trusted digital platform connecting technology executives to reimagine the enterprise and reshape the business world. We urge you to visit our website and become part of our digital journey. See you again soon.